Danny feels lonely and hurt after the death of his mother, Sam, in General Hospital. Sam's death not only shocked Port Charles, but especially hurt Danny. During Sam McCall's funeral, Danny's disappearance caused great chaos. Everyone who was already grieving over Sam's death suddenly became deeply worried when they realized Danny had been missing since the previous night. His disappearance, in the midst of such tension, added fuel to the fire, causing his family and friends to panic. Immediately, everyone started frantically searching for Danny, and anxiety swept through the entire funeral. Fear spread as no one knew what had happened to the boy. However, amidst the chaos, the shocking news came that Danny had gone to the place where his mother, Sam, had died. The fact that a child like Danny could act this way not only raised concerns about his physical well-being, but also led everyone to question his mental and emotional state. This raised many questions in everyone's minds. Why did Danny choose to go to the place where his mother died? Did he know something about her death that no one else did? Or was this simply his way of coping with the terrible loss? However, what caused even more panic was the lack of further information after it was discovered that Danny had gone to that place. Where had he gone? What was his condition? Was someone exploiting Danny's grief for darker purposes? These questions only increased the anxiety as people faced both, both Sam's loss and the fear for Danny's safety. The worst-case scenario in General Hospital could be that in his despair and overwhelming pain, Danny decided to end his life by jumping into the river, unable to bear living without his mother's love. With Sam's death and his strained, conflicted relationship with his father, Jason, Danny felt like there was no way out. At the moment, Danny still hasn't been found, but the fear of a tragic ending looms over all of Port Charles. This truly is a crisis for a child who has lost all support in his life. Danny has not only lost his mother, but also has to face challenges with his father, Jason. Jason had been away from Port Charles for a long time and Danny felt distant from him. Although their relationship improved, it was largely thanks to Sam's presence. Jason's life is always filled with danger, from his mafia-related activities to his connections with the WSB. Danny has always felt that he couldn't have a normal childhood because everything around Jason was chaos and unpredictability. After Sam's death, things got even more complicated when Danny's grandmother, Alexis, was taken into custody for her involvement in John's death. Alexis had helped Sonny in a scheme that led to this tragedy, and this caused Danny's anger to spiral out of control. He felt betrayed from all sides, Jason, the father who couldn't bring peace, and Alexis, the grandmother who contributed to his mother's death. Now Jason and Alexis are fighting for custody of Danny, which only deepens his pain. Their custody battle is not just a legal matter, but a reflection of Danny's emotional turmoil. Jason wants to keep him, but Danny doesn't feel safe with his father. He fears that living with Jason will pull him into an endless cycle of violence and danger. On the other hand, Alexis, despite being in jail, still tries to protect Danny, suggesting that he should live with her once she is free. But all of this makes Danny feel an unbearable amount of pressure. He has lost his mother and no longer trusts the adults around him. The custody battle between Jason and Alexis only deepens his pain. Indeed, Danny is truly an innocent child, and his disappearance during this tragic time only highlights his vulnerability and the deep hurt he is feeling. After Sam's death, Danny not only had to face the pain of losing his mother, but also went through confusion and fear when he went to the place where his mother passed away. This shows that Danny needs to be protected, loved, and cared for more than ever to heal from his severe emotional wounds. This event has not only deeply affected Danny's family, but could also lead to a significant change in Alexis's perspective, his grandmother and Sam's mother. Alexis has always tried to help Sonny in various situations, even though she knew his life was full of danger and violence. However, after the tragic loss of Sam and Danny's involvement in this cycle of grief, Alexis may reconsider her stance. Seeing that Sonny's decisions may have directly or indirectly caused great suffering for her family, Alexis might decide to distance herself from Sonny and stop helping him. Perhaps her top priority now is to focus on caring for and protecting Danny, ensuring that he won't have to endure any more pain or danger. This shift in Alexis's direction not only has personal implications, 
but could also cause major changes in her relationship with Sonny. Sonny, who is constantly torn between his dangerous life and his love for his family, will now have to face the consequences of his actions and decisions. This could lead to a tense confrontation between Alexis and Sonny, especially if Alexis is determined to do everything in her power to protect her grandson from the violence and pain Sonny may bring. From here, the story will open up many possible developments, focusing on how people cope with loss and make difficult decisions to protect their loved ones. Danny certainly deserves to live in love, and Alexis might become the one to lead this change, putting Danny at the forefront of her decisions. Thank you.